Antigua and Barbuda, Wikipedia article audio. Coordinates, 17 degrees 03 and 61 degrees 48 minutes west, slash, 17.050 degrees north 61.800 degrees west, slash 17.050, 61.800. Antigua and Barbuda V R B U D Slash and T G Barbu D is a sovereign state in the Americas, lying between the Caribbean Sea and the Atlantic Ocean. It consists of two major islands, Antigua and Barbuda, and a number of smaller islands. The permanent population numbers about 81,800 and the capital and largest port and city is St. John's, on Antigua. Etymology History Lying near each other, Antigua and Barbuda are in the middle of the Leeward Islands, part of the Lesser Antilles, roughly at 17 degrees north of the equator. The country's name was given by Christopher Columbus in 1493, after discovering the island in honor of the Virgin of La Antigua in the Seville Cathedral. The country is nicknamed Land of 365 Beaches due to the many beaches surrounding the islands. Its governance, language, and culture have all been strongly influenced by the British Empire, of which the country was formerly a part gaining sovereignty on November 1, 1981. It remains a member of the Commonwealth and Queen Elizabeth II is the head of state. In September 2017, Hurricane Irma damaged or destroyed 95% of Barbuda's buildings and infrastructure. Everyone on the island was evacuated to Antigua. Antigua is Spanish for ancient and Barbuda is Spanish for bearded. The island of Antigua, originally called Waydadli by Arawaks, is today called Waydadli by locals, Caribs possibly called it Waomoni. Christopher Columbus, while sailing by in 1493 may have named it Santa Maria la Antigua after an icon in the Spanish Seville Cathedral. Antigua was first settled by Archaic Age hunter-gatherer Amerindians called the Siboney or Siboney. Carbon dating has established the earliest settlements started around 3100 BC. They were succeeded by the Ceramic Age pre-Columbian Arawak-speaking Saladoid people who migrated from the lower Orinoco River. The Arawaks introduced agriculture, raising, among other crops, the famous Antigua black pineapple, corn, sweet potatoes, chilies, guava, tobacco, and cotton. Geography The indigenous West Indians made excellent seagoing vessels which they used to sail around on the Atlantic and the Caribbean. As a result, Caribs and Arawaks were able to colonize much of South America and the Caribbean islands. Their descendants still live there, notably in Brazil, Venezuela, and Colombia. Most Arawaks left Antigua around 1100 AD, those who remained were later raided by the Caribs. According to the Catholic Encyclopedia, the Caribs' superior weapons and seafaring prowess allowed them to defeat most of the West Indian Arawak nations, enslaving some and possibly cannibalizing others. Largest Cities The Catholic Encyclopedia makes it clear that the European invaders had difficulty differentiating between the various groups of the native peoples they encountered. As a result, the number and types of ethnic-slash-tribal groups in existence at that time may have been much more varied and numerous than just the two mentioned in this article. European and African diseases, malnutrition, and slavery eventually killed most of the Caribbean's native population. 
smallpox was probably the greatest killer. Some historians believe that the psychological stress of slavery may also have played a part in the massive number of deaths amongst enslaved natives. Others believe the reportedly abundant but starchy, low-protein diet may have contributed to their severe malnutrition as they were used to a diet fortified with protein from the sea. The Spaniards did not colonize Antigua because it lacked fresh water but not aggressive Caribs. The English settled on Antigua in 1632, Christopher Codrington settled on Barbuda in 1684. Slavery, established to run sugar plantations around 1684, was abolished in 1834. The British ruled from 1632 to 1981 with a brief French interlude in 1666. Islands The islands became an independent state within the Commonwealth of Nations on November 1, 1981, with Elizabeth II as the first Queen of Antigua and Barbuda. Veer Cornwall Bird Sr. became the first Prime Minister. Climate most of Barbuda was devastated in early September 2017 by Hurricane Irma, which brought winds with speeds reaching 295 km per hour. The storm damaged or destroyed 95% of the island's buildings and infrastructure, leaving Barbuda barely habitable according to Prime Minister Gaston Brown. Nearly everyone on the island was evacuated to Antigua. Ecology Antigua and Barbuda both are generally low-lying islands whose terrain has been influenced more by limestone formations than volcanic activity. The highest point on Antigua is Mount Obama, the remnant of a volcanic crater rising 402 meters. The shorelines of both islands are greatly indented with beaches, lagoons, and natural harbors. The islands are rimmed by reefs and shoals. There are few streams as rainfall is slight. Both islands lack adequate amounts of fresh groundwater. Demographics Antigua 17 degree 50, N61 degree 480, W slash 17.08333 degrees north 61.80000 degrees west slash 17.08333 61.80000 Barbuda 17 degree 37 0 and 61 degree 48 0 W slash 17.61667 degrees north 61.80000 degrees west slash 17.61667 61.80000 redonda 16 degree 56 20 and 62 degree 20 30 w slash 16.93889 degrees north 62.34167 degrees west slash 16.93889 62.34167 rainfall averages 990 mm per year with the amount varying widely from season to season in general the wettest period is between september and november the islands generally experience low humidity and recurrent droughts. Temperatures average 27 degrees Celsius, with a range from 23 degrees Celsius to 29 degrees Celsius in the winter to from 25 degrees Celsius to 30 degrees Celsius in the summer and autumn. The coolest period is between December and February. Hurricanes strike on an average of once a year including the powerful Category 5 Hurricane Irma, on September 6, 2017, 
which damaged 95% of the structures on Barbuda. Some 1,800 people were evacuated to Antigua. Ethnic Groups An estimate published by Time indicated that over $100 million would be required to rebuild homes and infrastructure. Fillmore Mullen, director of Barbuda's National Office of Disaster Services, said that all critical infrastructure and utilities are non existent food supply, medicine, shelter, electricity, water, communications waste management. He summarized the situation as follows, public utilities need to be rebuilt in their entirety. It is optimistic to think anything can be rebuilt in six months. In my 25 years in disaster management, I have never seen something like this. Languages The sandy soil on much of the islands has only scrub vegetation. Some parts of Antigua are more fertile most notably the central plain due to the volcanic ash in the soil. These areas support some tropical vegetation and agricultural uses. The planting of acacia, mahogany and red and white cedar on Antigua has led to as much as 11% of the land becoming forested, helping to conserve the soil and water. Prickly Pear Island 17 degree 1033, and 61 degree 4753, W, slash, 17.17583 degrees north 61.79806 degrees west, slash 17.17583, 61.79806, Great Bird Island 17 degree 8 46, and 61 degree 43 31, W, slash, 17.14611 degrees north 61.72528 degrees west, slash 17.14611, dash 61.72528, Galley Island Major 17 degree 08 35.5, and 61 degree 43 37.5, W, slash, 17.143194 degrees north 61.727083 degrees west, slash 17.143194, Dash 61.727083, Galley Island Minor, Jenny Island, Exchange Island 17 degree 0811, and 61 degree 4323, W, Slash, 17.13639 degrees north 61.72306 degrees west, Slash 17.13639, dash 61.72306, Rabbit Island 17 degree 810, and 61 degree 4352, W, slash, 17.13611 degrees north 61.73111 degrees west, Slash 17.13611, dash 61.73111, Lobster Island 17 degree 81, and 61 degree 4347, W, slash 17.13361 degrees north 61.72972 degrees west, Slash 17.13361, dash 61.72972, Long Island 17 degree 919, and 61 degree 4514, W, slash, 17.15528 degrees north 61.75389 degrees west, Slash 17.15528, dash 61.75389, Maiden Island 17 degree 844, 
N61 degree 45 48 W slash 17.14556 degrees north 61.76333 degrees west slash 17.14556 Dash 61.76333, Rat Island 17 degree 744, and 61 degree 4611, W, slash, 17.12889 degrees north 61.76972 degrees west, slash 17.12889, Dash 61.76972, Little Bird Island 17 degree 0927, and 61 degree 4417, W, slash, 17.15750 degrees north 61.73806 degrees west, slash 17.1550, Dash 61.73806, Hell's Gate Island 17 degree 826, and 61 degree 4318, W, slash, 17.14056 degrees north 61.72167 degrees west, slash 17.14056, Dash 61.72167, Monocle Point Island, Redhead Island 17 degree 816, and 61 degree 4341, W, Slash, 17.13778 degrees north 61.72806 degrees west, Slash 17.13778, Dash 61.72806, Guyana Island 17 degree 726, and 61 degree 4357, W, Slash, 17.12389 degrees north 61.73250 degrees west, Slash 17.12389, Dash 61.73250, Crump Island 17 degree 632, and 61 degree 43.8, W, Slash, 17.10889 degrees north 61.71889 degrees west, Slash 17.10889, Nanny Island 17 degree 0405, and 61 degree 4126, W, slash, 17.06806 degrees north 61.69056 degrees west, slash 17.06806, dash 61.69056, Lavis Counts Island 17 degree 557, and 61 degree 4324, W, slash, 17.09917 degrees north 61.72333 degrees west, slash 17.09917, dash 61.7233, Bird Island 17 degree 445, and 61 degree 4020, W, slash, 17.07917 degrees north 61.67222 degrees west, slash 17.07917, dash 61.67222, Round Island, Haas Island 17 degree 646, and 61 degree 4340, W, slash, 17.11278 degrees north 61.72778 degrees west, slash 17.11278, 
61.72778, Little Island, Green Island 17 degree 411, and 61 degree 3958, W, slash, 17.06972 degrees north 61.66611 degrees west, slash 17.06972, Dash 61.66611, Pelican Island 17 degree 0621, and 61 degree 4217, W, slash, 17.10583 degrees north 61.70472 degrees west, slash 17.10583, Dash 61.70472, York Island 17 degree 311, and 61 degree 49, W, slash, 17.05306 degrees north 61.66917 degrees west, slash 17.05306, Dash 61.66917, Codrington Island 17 degree 69, and 61 degree 4221, W, slash, 17.10250 degrees north 61.70583 degrees west, slash 17.1050, Minus 61.70583. Antigua has a population of 100,963, mostly made up of people of West African, British, and made Iran descent. The ethnic distribution consists of 91% black and mulatto, 4.4% mixed race, 1.7% white, and 2.9% other. Most whites are of Irish or British descent. Christian Levantine Arabs, and a small number of Asians and Sephardic Jews make up the remainder of the population. An increasingly large percentage of the population lives abroad, most notably in the United Kingdom, United States, and Canada. A minority of Antiguan residents are immigrants from other countries particularly from Dominica, Guiana, and Jamaica, and, increasing, from the Dominican Republic, St. Vincent and the Grenadines and Nigeria. An estimated 4,500 American citizens also make their home in Antigua and Barbuda, making their numbers one of the largest American populations in the English-speaking Eastern Caribbean. Goat Island 17 degree 42 20, and 61 degree 50 49, W, slash, 17.70556 degrees north 61.84694 degrees west, slash 17.70556, dash 61.84694, Kid Island 17 degree 41 47, and 61 degree 48 52, W, slash, 17.69639 degrees north 61.81444 degrees west, slash 17.69639, dash 61.81444, Man of War Island 17 degree 45, and 61 degree 51 5, W, slash, 17.66806 degrees north 61.85139 degrees west, slash 17.66806, dash 61.85139, Rabbit Island 17 degree 42 23, and 61 degree 49 36, W, slash, 17.70639 degrees north 61.82667 degrees west, 
slash 17.70639, minus 61.82667. English is the official language. The Barbudan accent is slightly different from the Antiguan. Religion Governance Political system Elections In the years before Antigua and Barbuda's independence, Standard English was widely spoken in preference to Antiguan Creole. Generally, the upper and middle classes shun Antiguan Creole. The educational system dissuades the use of Antiguan Creole and instruction is done in Standard English. Many of the words used in the Antiguan dialect are derived from British as well as African languages. This can be easily seen in phrases such as, and it, meaning ain't it, which is itself dialectal and means isn't it. Common island proverbs can often be traced to Africa. Spanish is spoken by around 10,000 inhabitants. A majority of 77% of Antiguans are Christians, with the Anglicans being the largest single denomination. Other Christian denominations present are Seventh-day Adventist Church, Pentecostalism, Moravian Church, Roman Catholics, Methodist Church, Wesleyan Holiness Church, Church of God, Baptists, Mormons, and Jehovah's Witnesses. Non-Christian religions practiced in the islands include the Rastafari, Islam, and Baha'i faith. The politics of Antigua and Barbuda take place within a framework of a unitary, parliamentary, representative democratic monarchy, in which the head of state is the monarch who appoints the governor-general as vice-regal representative. Elizabeth II is the present Queen of Antigua and Barbuda having served in that position since the island's independence from the United Kingdom in 1981. The Queen is currently represented by Governor-General Sir Rodney Williams. A Council of Ministers is appointed by the Governor-General on the advice of the Prime Minister, currently Gaston Brown. The Prime Minister is the head of government. Executive power is exercised by the government while legislative power is vested in both the government and the two chambers of parliament. The bicameral parliament consists of the Senate, and the House of Representatives to serve five-year terms. Party Elections The current leader of Her Majesty's loyal opposition is the United Progressive Party Member of Parliament, the Honorable Baldwin Spencer. The last elections held were on June 12, 2014, during which the Antigua Labour Party won 14 seats, and the United Progressive Party 3 seats. Since 1949, elections have been won by the populist Antigua Labour Party. However, in the Antigua and Barbuda legislative election of 2004 saw the defeat of the longest-serving elected government in the Caribbean. Prime Minister Lester Bryant Byrd, who had succeeded his father Veer Cornwall Byrd Sr., and Deputy Robin Yearwood had been in office since 1976. Judiciary Foreign Relations Military the elder Bird was Prime Minister from 1981 to 1994 and Chief Minister of Antigua from 1960 to 1981, except for the 1971-1976 period when the Progressive Labour Movement defeated his party. Veer Cornwall Bird, the nation's first Prime Minister, is credited with having brought Antigua and Barbuda and the Caribbean into a new era of independence. Gaston Brown defeated his predecessor Lester Bryant Bird at the Antigua Labour Party's biennial convention in November 2012 held to elect a political leader and other officers. The party then altered its name from the Antigua Labour Party to the Antigua and Barbuda Labour Party.
This was done to officially include the party's presence on the sister island of Barbuda in its organization, the only political party on the mainland to have a physical branch in Barbuda. The judicial branch is the Eastern Caribbean Supreme Court. Antigua is also a member of the Caribbean Court of Justice. The Judicial Committee of the Privy Council serves as its Supreme Court of Appeal. Antigua and Barbuda is a member of the United Nations, the Bolivarian Alliance for the Americas, the Commonwealth of Nations, the Caribbean Community, the Organization of Eastern Caribbean States, the Organization of American States, the World Trade Organization and the Eastern Caribbean's Regional Security System. Antigua and Barbuda is also a member of the International Criminal Court. Administrative Divisions In 2013, Antigua and Barbuda called for reparations for slavery at the United Nations. Prime Minister Baldwin Spencer said we have recently seen a number of leaders apologizing, and that they should now match their words with concrete and material benefits. The Royal Antigua and Barbuda Defence Force has around 260 members dispersed between the Line Infantry Regiment, Service and Support Unit and Coast Guard. There is also the Antigua and Barbuda Cadet Corps made up of 200 teenagers between the ages of 12 to 18. Antigua and Barbuda is divided into six parishes and two dependencies. Note, though Barbuda and Redonda are called dependencies they are integral parts of the state, making them essentially administrative divisions. Dependency is simply a title. Tourism dominates the economy, accounting for more than half of the gross domestic product. Antigua is famous for its many luxury resorts. Weak tourist activity since early 2000 has slowed the economy, however, and squeezed the government into a tight fiscal corner. Investment banking and financial services also make up an important part of the economy. Major world banks with offices in Antigua include the Royal Bank of Canada and Scotia Bank. Financial services corporations with offices in Antigua include Price Waterhouse Coopers. The U.S. Securities and Exchange Commission has accused the Antigua based Stanford International Bank, owned by Texas billionaire Alan Stanford of orchestrating a huge fraud which may have bilked investors of some $8 billion. The Twin Island Nation's agricultural production is focused on its domestic market and constrained by a limited water supply and a labor shortage stemming from the lure of higher wages in tourism and construction work. Manufacturing is made up of enclave-type assembly for export, the major products being bedding, handicrafts, and electronic components. Prospects for economic growth in the medium term will continue to depend on income growth in the industrial East world, especially in the United States, from which about one-third of all tourists come. Following the opening of the American University of Antigua College of Medicine by investor and attorney Neil Simon in 2003, a new source of revenue was established. The university employs many local Antiguans and the approximate 1,000 students consume a large amount of the goods and services. Antigua and Barbuda also utilizes an economic citizenship program to spur investment into the country. Economy Education Antigua and Barbuda has a greater than 90% literacy rate. In 1998, Antigua and Barbuda adopted a national mandate to become the preeminent provider of medical services in the Caribbean. As part of this mission, Antigua and Barbuda built the most technologically advanced hospital in the Caribbean, the M.T. St. John Medical Center. 
The island of Antigua currently has two foreign-owned for-profit offshore medical schools, the American University of Antigua, founded in 2004, and the University of Health Sciences Antigua, founded in 1982. The island's sole medical schools cater mostly to foreign students but contribute tremendously to the local economy and healthcare and help give the small country international attention. There is also a government-owned state college in Antigua as well as the Antigua and Barbuda Institute of Information Technology and the Antigua and Barbuda Hospitality Training Institute. The University of the West Indies has a branch in Antigua for locals to continue university studies. Culture Antigua has two international primary-slash-secondary schools including CET International, which offers the Ontario Secondary School Diploma, and Island Academy, which offers the International Baccalaureate. There are also many other private schools but these institutions tend to follow the same local curriculum as government schools. Both international schools are relatively inexperienced with offering international degrees. XET International has existed for several years but only began offering an international degree in 2007. While XET's graduating classes have consistently been awarded the OSSD, this is somewhat controversial because CSET students receive their diplomas from one of CSET's partner schools based in Ontario. Festivals Cuisine Media Local literature Sports Notables Symbols the culture is predominantly a mixture of West African and British cultural influences. Cricket is the national sport. Other popular sports include football, boat racing and surfing. Calypso and soca music, both originating primarily out of Trinidad, are important in Antigua and Barbuda. The National Carnival held each August commemorates the abolition of slavery in the British West Indies, although on some islands, Carnival may celebrate the coming of Lent. Its festive pageants, shows, contests and other activities are a major tourist attraction. Corn and sweet potatoes play an important role in Antiguan cuisine. For example, a popular Antiguan dish, Dukuna slash du, ku, n, slash is a sweet, steamed dumpling made from grated sweet potatoes, flour, and spices. One of the Antiguan staple foods, fungi slash fu, n d, i, slash, is a cooked paste made of cornmeal and water. There are two daily newspapers, The Daily Observer and Caribbean Times. The local channel ABS TV 10 is available. There are also several local and regional radio stations, such as V2C AM 620, ZDK M 1100, Vibs FM 92.9, ZDK FM 97.1. Observer Radio 91.1 FM, Dineka Radio 90.1 FM, Second Advent Radio 101.5 FM, Abundant Life Radio 103.9 FM, Crusader Radio 107.3 FM, Nice FM 104.3. Jamaica Kincaid, has published over 20 pieces of literature. The Antigua and Barbuda national cricket team represented the country at the 1998 Commonwealth Games, but Antiguan cricketers otherwise play for the Leeward Islands cricket team in domestic matches and the West Indies cricket team internationally. The 2007 Cricket World Cup was hosted in the West Indies from March 11 to April 28, 2007.
Antigua hosted eight matches at the Sir Vivian Richards Stadium, which was completed on February 11, 2007 and can hold up to 20,000 people. Antigua is a host of Stanford 2020-2020 cricket, a version started by Alan Stanford in 2006 as a regional cricket game with almost all Caribbean islands taking part. Rugby and netball are popular as well. Association football, or soccer, is also a very popular sport. Antigua has a national football team which entered World Cup qualification for the 1974 tournament and for 1986 and onwards. A professional team was formed in 2011, Antigua Barracuda FC, which played in the USL Pro, a lower professional league in the USA. The nation's team had a major achievement in 2012 getting out of its preliminary group for the 2014 World Cup, notably due to a victory over powerful Haiti. In its first game in the next CONCACAF group play on June 8, 2012 in Tampa, FL, Antigua and Barbuda, comprising 17 Barracuda players and seven from the lower English professional leagues, scored a goal against the United States. However, the team lost 3-1 to the U.S. The national bird is the frigate bird, and the national tree is the Taliparatia latum. Click on a colored area to see an article about English in that country or region.